Uh, hi all, it's Robert Bennett here with TCA. I just want to make a quick video to show you how to change what emails you get from the TCA community and when you get those emails. I'm going to go ahead and share my screen real quick. So here I am in the community. I'm in the members group. Up here in the top right corner is my face. Should be your face. If not, there's a problem. I'm going to click my face and then go down to profile settings. Now, this is the dashboard that allows you to control all the emails that you get from the community. Really, there's two different kinds. Uh, there's the digest emails, which summarize things that happened that day. So if you don't want to get the like, like an email for each post, you can just get one of these, which summarizes all the stuff that happened that day. And next up is an email that you get the second that something happens. There's lots of things that could trigger that. I'll go into that in a little bit. But let's start with the digest here. If I want to get the digest, then I turn these on. It's just a little toggle here. And then I'm gonna click this drop down, and this allows me to choose which groups I want to get a digest for. So if there's a group that I am interested in, but I don't wanna stay completely up to date on, um, then I can leave this checked. And then I will get a, um, get, a, get a digest each morning, letting me know this stuff has happened. It's really, it, it's that simple. If you don't wanna get them, you can just go ahead and turn them off. And next up is, um, the emails that go out the second that something happens on the community. For example, posts. If you want to get an email the second that someone posts on a group on the community, then you would turn this on here and then you can choose which ones you want to get. Now, I am an admin, so I am in all the groups and I want to stay up to date on all the posts that have groups. But if there's really only like one or two, for example, in CTOs and tech directors. If you want to get an email each time that someone makes a post in this group, then you would just leave this checked and you can uncheck all the rest. Or if you want to get a post each time that someone makes, makes uh, if you want to uh, have it so that you get an email each time that someone makes a post in any group, you can leave them all checked. It's completely up to you. Next up is our manager announcements. As an admin, there's times that I want to let y'all know about something that's happening. I send out uh, um, a manager announcement through that, it, uh, it, like it goes out to everybody. But if you don't want to get those, you can just go ahead and turn this off. Or if there are specific groups that you want to get those for, you can leave those turned off. Next is comments on all posts. If you want to get an email each time someone makes a comment on a post, you can uh, set up that filter here. Next is comments on posts that I, that I created. If I make a post and I want to hear every time that someone uh, makes a comment on it. If I say that I have a problem, someone says, here's how I did it. And I want to get an email when someone says that, I leave that turn on here. Next up is comments on posts that I participate in. For example, if I make a comment on a post saying, hey, this worked for me. And then someone comes up and says, this didn't work for me. Do you want to get that email? You can turn that on here and you can choose the group that it's for here as well. Next up is the private replies to your post. You can turn that on or off here. And then there's conversations that you're in. That's um, uh, a direct message from a member to member on community. Uh, you can turn that on and off here. And next up is the mentions of you. And if you don't want to get these at all, you can just turn them all off. This is not your bag. If you get enough emails, then you can just switch all these to off and then you're good to go. Uh, that's about it. This has been Robert Bennett here with TCA. Thank you for joining me and let me know if you have any questions.